Hello you guys, this is Chase Perry in here today. I got some comments on the last video, which is fishing bait. And right now I'm gonna just do a little bit of a uh, fishing rod in Rio. So let's see, I'm gonna show mine first because my brother has some wants to show. But this is mine. Right here it's a uh, Can't really see it. So. Left. So if you see that right there, that's the brand. And all right, let me hold this. Hold this Bentley. Uh, my brother's name is Bentley. If you guys were wondering. So if you want to, this is my first rod. Uh, if you like spinning rod and reels, I recommend this. It's Pretty easy to use. I mean, for beginners, don't get this spinning rod, wheel, bait caster, or anything. Wait, this is eight. This thing here can hold up to eight pound, twelve pound line. But I have, I only have eight on here, but this can hold up to twelve pound, which is pretty good. I mean, I recommend for somebody to get this fishing pole. This thing, this thing's about a six foot fishing pole I got from Dick Sporting Goods. You can get from Walmart and stuff. But pretty nice, I mean, easy cast. <clears throat> Simple, I mean, I can hold up. Like that was one, I can hold it up, just easy to hold up. I mean, just not, e not even a pound. The reels, you know, sometimes reels are close and they get in your way. This one's a couple inches away from the thing. Then, of course, it, my next rod. So, since I have my next rod, this is my first, not my first ever rod. What well, is my first ever rod? I used to only use my dad's, but this one, it's this little, this is what beginners should get. That, that, and all that. This is Sharpie, Sharpie, whatever that brand is. Maybe that. This, this can hold the. This is from Dick's Sporting Goods too, or Walmart. I think it's from Walmart and Dick's Sporting Goods. Two to six pound line on this thing. I have five pound. I've caught in bass with this thing plenty of times. It's good. It's a good rod. Yeah. Good rods, but I know there's a guy that's called like. I don't know. He said I should nice baits and stuff, which I do like his videos. I have never watched that. I watched one today, and it's pretty cool. Now, this is my catfishing rod. This is the reel off of a different fishing pole. I was in a fishing tournament with my, friend, with my cousins and stuff, and I won. I didn't win a trophy. I won three trophies, and I chose this, a fishing rod, a reel. It's a Walmart type. It's a nice fishing rod. Yep. And I cast it. But I will be making a video here soon on changing the reel on this rod and stuff. Because I do, this line is pretty messed up. That was all for my fishing poles. So now I'm going to show my brothers. Of course. I'll show you fishing poles for This is a, uh, do you know what brand it is? Uh, from... That was from the uh, tournament. Uh, this is another one from a tournament. It's like Walmart Dicks. It's a uh, South Bend. Uh, pretty nice. Isn't it? Yeah, good eyes. It's pretty, I mean, this is that eight pound line. It's only supposed to hold the five pound line or six pound actually. But I put eight pound. It handles eight pound like a pro. This is another good fishing rod. Ultra light, very light fishing rod. I mean, this is good. And you guys can comment down below or give me a shout out. Some I need subscribers. Cause if once I get the momentum from subscribers, I will start making fishing videos. Just not well. Cause I don't live a pond near a pond, and my dad's a little. This is another fishing pole, same as mine. Just same thing, same thing. This is called like a 10 pound, it's not a 5 pound, 
pretty crazy. That's all for this fish bowl. Taste, taste, tell me, tell me that she bought one down No, tell me. Shush. I just did. You did? I said, what? Well, 10 pounds. You said 5 pounds. I said 10 pounds. So there's 5 pounds right there. And since I did a tackle box review on mine, uh, he wants, do you want to do a tackle box review? Let's see if you're going to do it. Do you want to do one? Nope. All right. Let me get the tackle box review. Let's do it. It's, he has a tackle box I gave to him. He, Very disappointing. He has a lot of like check the side pockets. He was gonna look on top. Not the little side pockets. He has no clippers. He smashed his fingers. Now, uh, he just you know these. No, that's not. But turn off the fan. We have one of these little guys. I never tried them. These are all brand new. Which is he has an ugly stick, but. He uh, got his line up in a rat's nest. Yep. Which this is pretty good. At this little bit here. So I will sh no, don't show none of the worms yet. Okay. I'll show you a piece for you. Now, then I, he got this bait. Uh, if you could comment down below or like give us a shout out or make a YouTube video on how to use one, or, like comment down below. I do not know how to use one. And I got. Big worm and some other spinning bait. Then I got turn on my fan. It's super hot in here. <laughs> yeah, it is hot. Got yeah, these little guys. Let's show my. Uh, I will. I will just uh, the split tail. The tail that wiggles. Hurry up! <clears throat> Sorry, you guys. Turn it on high. High three. Two. Then. Yeah, that's good. He got all of his little weights. It's not so much. I know, I lay it on. And then we got this little hook with the eyeball. What do you want to say now? I'm telling him that this was from. The yeah, everything in here was basically from his ugly stick. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't matter though. Got these little things, hooks, mm -hmm. tackle box, mm -hmm. these little worms. The Oh no, it's like a balancing you Can I this one? Yeah. He had a couple of these ones for me. And he, we found these that the, my uh, cousin gave to us. And they had these uh, and red worms. And skinny white ones. White ones. And these white ones. I mean yellow ones. I've already showed them how else. Now, for, all right. First things first, you always gotta have a little bit of a worm rag, and that's what me I have here. He has, and I can I speak very. There's some sand. Wow. See, we got this guy right here. Walmart when they wiggle wiggle, flap it down. Comment down below, someone. Tell me, tell us if they're good baits. He's never caught a fish. I've caught like. Big, big bass on a worm, not his. Then, of course, he has some more hooks that you do not have to tie on. Then, I've never really experienced this. I mean, me and my brother, I'm into fishing. I know that. But, like, can you guys tell me about this bait right here? Just what am I this? I don't get it. I caught one fish. What happened to your other bait? Didn't you buy two baits like this or something? Oh yeah, um, I traded it out for something. Oh yeah, I traded it out for this. Hey, you didn't, you tra didn't trade nothing off of that. You, didn't you hook something onto your sheets? Oh yeah, the um, the other one that I got from Dix, that dad bought from Bass Pro Shop. No, it wasn't bad from Bass Pro Shop. Oh, this is from that Shop. <clears throat> There's the other one. Yeah, uh, a while. Can you take this out? Um, that's this one. There's an open one. sand on it. We have a sandy on it. Look at this little guy. My nose is itchy. 
See this guy? He looks dope. I got a fish on. You guys need to recommend us what these baits like where to fish at? We fish out in the pond with a lot of sticks. Cheers. Cheers. Tom that I caught a big bass with those baits. These two Cheers. dark bobber. He's caught a pretty big bass with those baits. Cheers, he caught a bass with this big. And of course you got Cheers. the uh Really, I know. <laughs> then you got these shiners. And red shiners and clear shiners. These are the epic ones, glow in the dark bait. Uh, that's about all for what he has, except for a fish hanger. And if you guys like keep on like giving us subscribers and someone gives us a shout out who has a bunch of subscribers, we will start making fishing videos. Me and him, we're, I'm good at fishing. Now, that was the name YouTube channel was. Chase. What's that? I forgot what his name was, but I like him so he has good bait and stuff. No, I'm not your YouTube channel, I don't have one. And stuff that pretty cool. Comment down below whenever you want to see a fishing video and if you want to see us catch bass. And right now it's kind of dirty water where we live. We live in Maryland, Hinesville, Maryland. And we go to this place. Well, I don't like to tell anybody because it's like more all over. Neighborhood place. My dad grew up there his entire life, but blah, 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 blah. Then we go there. That's where we go fishing. And there's like good, there's like a 10 pound bass in there. Big, big bass. I caught a catfish. He caught a this catfish, bluegill, sunfish, crappie, bass. Snapping turtles. Snapping this turtles, snapping turtles, all kinds of fish. You guys just get me more subscribers and I will be interested in making fishing videos and stuff. And see you guys later and peace out.